Now, unless some creepier shit happen, which I can't. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> What's good y'all welcome back or welcome if you are new thank you for checking out the video i hope y'all enjoyed the bizarre bub video from yesterday i most definitely did so we finna work our way backwards and react to his previous video before that one scary comp version 34 original video link will be down in the description let's get into the video michael i already know how this shit go ain't no need to really explain some scary shit there's something about this place that doesn't sit well with them every so often something strange happens an object moves on its own, or a strange noise is heard at night. But then one day, as they were watching TV in the living room, something really strange happens. Michael writes, This happened while watching TV. This is what they caught. Hey, sort of. Immediately, I would have been like, who is banging on my door? It's getting louder as she's getting closer. Nobody's there. Okay. Yo, you can see the glass move. Nah, bro. You want to know what it would have said right in front of my uh, yard immediately? For sale. I couldn't live like this. You do not pay bills. Stop banging on my walls. Bro, this shit would piss me off. Like, this ghost is dummy disrespectful. Because there are some ghosts that are like, fuck with you here and there. See, look, you over here throwing my equipment? Oh, nah, you would have had big problems. You would have got exercise so fast, holy water would have been all up in the crib. Sage everywhere. Both Michael and Heather don't no. know what to make of this. But it seems like they might be dealing with something paranormal. They're not entirely sure if that's the case. But then one night, after this happened, they captured this. Uh, enough is already going on. There don't need to be nothing else. I like how he's trying to get an angle on the... Wow, hold on. Hey, yeah, check behind that curtain. See, he know. Mm -mm. It is at this point that Michael and Heather don't know what to do. Viewers of the video suggest they leave, but it seems like until they figure out what's going on, they'll make that decision. But what do you think is happening? Could this be something related to the paranormal, or is it something else? Let me know what you think. Paranormal most deaf. Dominic Audios is woken up in the middle of the night by something. He takes a look around his room, but can't see what it is that jolted him out of his sleep. But just when he thought that it was nothing, Dominic begins to feel uneasy. Dominic writes, I was home alone, and this happened. This is what he caught. Okay, so the light flickered by itself. I need to sleep. Stop. Oh, no. You need to leave. This is my home. Oh, the cat's right there chilling, too. If there was to another stop. person there, I don't think this the cat would be like... And might be, depending on who the person is. Like always, nothing. Okay, cat's gone. Eyes still flickering. Stop. Turn it off. 
I need to sleep. Thank you. Now leave. He's talking to it very it calmly. Oh my. And it's, it's responsive. Dominic has no explanation for this. Hmm. This incident has left him spooked and questioning whether or not he should find a new place. But then one night, just when he thought that something like this wouldn't happen again, he's woken up once more. But this time, what he captures on camera has left him not only baffled, but extremely terrified. Dominic wakes up and encounters this. You... Y'all don't understand the shivers that just went down my spine. I didn't notice it there at first, and then when I saw it, chills. What the fuck is that? I'm a, like, I was going to say be bold and go to it. <laughs> Nigga, what? For sale. For sale. Just like the last one. A dark apparition can be seen looking at Dominic as he wakes up from his sleep. Dominic thought a stranger had broken in, but after taking a closer mm. look, he immediately sees that the trespasser is neither Nigga, a stranger nor a person. If that was a stranger, else. you finna get your ass beat over here recording them and not having a weapon a in hand. Occurrence, according to Dominic. But as usual, what do you think? That real was some creepy shit. I don't know. know. I don't know, but I feel like it was real creep me out for sure. Urban explorer Lalo Escalante is at a cemetery with a friend when they come across a small crypt containing a life-size doll. Didn't we see this one? We seen this one in like a recent, in a different video. There's something about the doll that unsettles them. And so they immediately proceed to walk away. But after only walking a couple of feet, they capture this. And I had said, why are they in like the cemetery and shit? ¿Quién está aquí con nosotros? Queremos verte. Queremos que te manifiestes. Oh, no. Look, asking you shall receive. That's crazy. I'm shitting myself. Okay. Now, him doing that made me kind of skeptical. Because they were just there. They did walk away. And that was a really like low key kind of like a loud creak. So I feel like if it was closed properly, you would that it would have had to move it up. You would have heard the creak, and then it would have opened. So I feel like they just didn't close that shit back properly. Nah, unless some creepier shit happened, which I can't. Yeah, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> I forgot I was just gonna say, but if some more creepy shit happened, I don't know. And then that motherfucker moved his head and started licking it. The doll's it. head moves on its own. That is Both clear. Both and his friend were terrified. They're certain that whatever moved its head wasn't due to some sort of mechanical function. No mechanical function at all. That is a straight doll. It's back to the wall. You can see the shadow, so it's not. It's no type of like CGI fucking edit nothing like that none of that that doll moved it moved i don't care what none of y'all say built into the doll but rather something supernatural but what do you think this might have mm, been mm. i'll leave it to you to decide eugene forey submitted the following video and writes this figure was caught on camera in the office where i work at we noticed the place was haunted but no one believed us until we saw this on camera. All right, let's see what y'all caught. That is a dark apparition. Walking and you, that was a, that was clear. It walked in there. That's a full apparition. Feet, legs, torso, arms, all of that. 
A shadowy figure can be seen entering and That's exiting not a, a room figure. at a very slow pace. Full body. Now, this could easily be explained away by the darkness of the hallway. It's too dark to see what it actually is, which but it's may just transparent. be a person. You can but see after through it. the brightness of the footage, it seems like this might have actually been something else. But I'll leave it to you to decide if that's the case. You can see through it. Let me know what you think. No, that bitch is haunted. They were right. It was haunted. The following image was submitted by Ryan Baker, who was exploring an abandoned warehouse. Ooh, this looks creepy, but Loki kind of dope to take pictures. He had taken a makeshift 360 camera assembled out of four camcorders, each of which were pointing a certain direction, north, east, south, and west. It was the south cam that caught something really disturbing. Ryan writes, Here's a snapshot of the footage captured by the south cam. I don't know what to make of it, but ever since capturing this, I haven't been able to sleep at night. Why the fuck did he do me like that? I wasn't expecting him to just put it on camera. That shit scared the fuck. What is that? It is looking right at you. Whatever that is, does it move? It was now just a snapshot. Creepy. Bro, you, I wish you would have had some video footage. That would have been insane. Starzy is shooting a video at what appears to be a lake. The majority of her videos consist of this type of format, in which something that many would consider unusual is being shown. However, in a video she recently posted, something very unusual happens. Viewers were creeped out when they saw it, as it seems like she might have caught something unexpected in the background. I'm in the river, and I'm having a baptism. Let's just let her go. A baptism. Oh my god, we actually know. But anyways, I'm in the river. I hope there's like, I keep hearing like voices, but I hope there's not like a man. Mm -mm. Right this behind Starzy is, is what seems to be a child mean. dressed in black mm -mm. and pointing at something. Viewers were left spooked by the appearance of this mysterious child. Starzy has yet to respond to viewers who believe that she might have caught the ghost of a child who drowned at this lake. Until she responds with an explanation, this footage remains a mystery. What the fuck was the explanation? Can, what, you're not gonna give us the explanation? Wow, really just, wow, really left us hanging. But what, what, what's his name? Bub Bubbles? Bizarre Bub? I said Bubbles. <laughs> Nah, but Bizarre Bub, this, I, I, he got some good compilations. I'm not even gonna lie, this shit is fire. I'm fucking with it. Y'all let me know down in the comments which one y'all thought was the creepiest. Um, Y'all already know which ones got me because I most definitely jumped multiple times. But I hope y'all enjoyed the reaction. Let me know down in the comments. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all next one. I love y'all. Peace. I may finesse the bitch if I'm able. Uh, run up, you catch a clip, get disabled. Uh, I never kill my brother.